All right, so we are back in Arm of Three over back. Essekur. It's a whole new world out here on a new map, which I've actually played on once before, but uh, yeah, we're checking it out on Armor 3 Overpack. I played this on Wasteland for a little bit. It seems to be a pretty good map, but uh, this is Overpack, so it's kind of been a while since I last played Overpack. Since then, LCG has come out with this map for Overpack. As I said, so far it seems to be a pretty good map, so uh, yeah, we're going to play in it. So today I'm playing with Gibbs and Fizuki, and uh, Gibbs actually has a base on this map. Which, well, I haven't really shown off the base building in Overpack just yet. I've looked at, like, one base, which looked like shit. Uh, we're gonna check out this base. He's, uh, he's willing to give me a base tour, so... We're gonna look around and see whether or not this base is, in fact, 10 out of 10. Or 0 out of 10. I don't know, we'll see. Gibbs, open up! Coming to raid your base. Hello, uh, what is the password? Password? I think that's the password. Yeah. Giant pineapple. <laughs> Giant pineapple is the correct one. Enter. Okay, so it's a two-door system. This is the airlock for entering vehicles, uh, but I quite regularly hit hit the edge of the the uh, the doors. So. Uh, so is the oh, whoa there? Is the code lock system in this also three digits? Same as a two. Uh, there is no code lock for the doors. No? It's all based on the plot pole. Oh, that's pretty handy. But they have just implemented key codes for the lock boxes, which is quite nice. So you can just share certain lock boxes with certain people. I'm also assuming these fences are totally not bulletproof. They are definitely not bulletproof. Okay. <laughs> As we have found out a few times. But basically, we've got a perimeter fence, which is nice. So you can come out here and get a suntan. Okay. So get like your garage right here. Can you actually use those uh, uh, ramps to jump out for now? No, that, that, that's just a because the perimeter, the the outer perimeter wall is uh, more of a newer addition. This was yeah. the okay, well, first right. stage of the base, and this was you know a bit. Of, <laughs> some Bowman's. You right there? Okay, yeah, critical mission failure. Um, do you have a revive gun? The, uh, I do. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Something went horribly wrong. You have to aim for the balls, or it don't work. I shot him in the nostril. That looks like a taser. Right, thank you. Uh, slight technical difficulties. Uh, we're gonna continue on. So, so far, it's looking okay. Can't complain. Uh, catwalk. It looks like uh, scaffolding. Yeah. You're planning on uh, extending those walls? Uh, yeah, at some point. Uh, get quite bored of building, so it's kind of just framework. But that does lead up to the roof. Okay. Or oh, oh, two folks. roofs. Yeah, yeah, watch out. Is he for? So, yeah, slight technical difficulties, uh, but nothing a pickup can't fix. So we're gonna continue on with this base tour, even though I think it was pretty much already over, but... Uh, so far it's looking like an okay base. I mean, I don't really know whether or not you can build anything majorly pretty in A3 overpack. But, it seems to be okay. Right, I'm gonna take it real slow on the stairs now. You should put up some guardrails there. Yeah, we do plan on uh, putting some halves in the walls as guardrails. <laughs> that's, that's definitely taking it slow. Right. You're doing well. Well done. So basically that balcony just uh, enables you to access, access this roof, which is uh, a beautiful vantage point for shooting north. Missions do spawn just on that road and around this area, so it's good for taking out AI or shooting down at the main door. Fortunately, I can't show you inside these doors. It's a top secret area. Uh, let's see. Lockbox. Uh. Hmm. Okay, I'll show you. Okay, this looks pretty top secret, man. Okay, I feel like we're trapped now. Haha! -ha! I was joking all along, that is the prison! <laughs> is it actually your prison? He fell for the bait room. Whoa, whoa, stop, stop! Enjoy, good sirs. Um. 
At 12 o'clock noon, I will throw you over a baguette. And at the tea time, <laughs> I will throw you a croissant. Variety. <laughs> croissant and butter. Sounded had a pretty okay bit over, I suppose. Uh, but we're going to go out and uh, probably see where now we can shoot some people. Uh, we look pretty well geared, so I figure we should be able to do something with these weapons. And bush rags. Look at that ghillie suit. That's a good looking ghillie suit right there. That is close. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Oh. Can anyone see where the traces are coming from? Yeah, uh, straight ahead of us. Front right. To the right in the gap in the, in the wall. Yeah. You're heading straight towards him. Is that the plan? I see him. I see him. Are you like gonna smash down the Big wall? Guy. Yay, motherfucker! Oh, oh you can get away with that. Oh, what's that rapid fire shit? Is that one you Yeah, does? we're getting shot at more people here. I think. Yeah, uh, the hunter is down, by the way. Oh, opposite side of the airfield on the hill. Oh shit, I'm dead. Uh, East. The other way, the other way, the other way. Way I'm facing right well, there's now. There's definitely one up there. Front of the hunter. Okay, well, we're covered. Fucking turn. How do you use this gun to repair the hunter? Shoot it, just shoot the hunter. Okay, go, get in. No, that didn't, that didn't work. Shit, I respawned by instant. Go. Okay, go, go, get in, get in, get in. Go. <laughs> now we're going backwards. Are we in? No, we're not. Fuck you! Go in. <laughs> quickly, quickly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. Try to leave me behind. Did someone die? Yes. See, I sort of got killed. Uh, I actually flanked around this one guy and then shot him repeatedly in the back. But yeah, then he just turned around and shot me, so uh, apparently that's what Mark II body armor can do. It can just stop 7.62 51 NATO rounds, like they're fucking bits of popcorn being thrown at you, so uh, that was quite interesting. It's giving me like flashbacks to, uh, I think, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 with a painkiller, death streak perk thingy. That was quite bad, but uh, we're, uh, we're continuing on. We got another Ezra 25, and uh, we're gonna go use this thing. Hopefully, this time, this thing can actually kill somebody. It should be able to, so yeah, and uh, keep doing some missions. There's a very treacherous tree line right above me. Be sure to cover me. Oh, I can't see jack shit from here. They're out there in the open. You should be able to see this. All right, it's blocked by trees. Uh, well. Bullshit. That's me. It's still me. Oh, um, I just got killed by someone. No. Uh, from the Okay, end. well, I died instantly. I have no idea where the fuck he was. Yeah, he's on my body. On my body right now. And where exactly was your body? You're not seeing my hex anymore. Is that not an old one? I haven't respawned yet. Yeah, shit, that's really far away though. It is. Someone else is shooting as well. Or 21 meters away. Yeah, he's letting me. I respawn should have a fucking revive. Shaking a bit too much here. Well, I'm not in a great spot here. But this is the best I can do right now. I'm just gonna stay here, I think. Out there is pretty open, but I don't know. The rest of it, it seems pretty safe. It's like big concrete barriers right here. I might be alright. Okay, that seems like it's AI. Oh shit. Right, as long as they don't turn around and start shooting at me. 
Oh okay. yeah. No. No, I think I should get somebody else. I might be good here. Oh shit. Go, you can't. Why is my guy walking so slowly? I'm not doing anything, he's just walking slowly. Doesn't really help that I'm in the middle of the objective right here. So, yeah. Nope. Right. Well, you got some good cover now, that AI are dead. Uh. No. Okay, I'm gonna fucking die here. I literally cannot fucking walk. Why am I? Uh, what? I don't, I don't understand. Why is he walking so slowly? It couldn't possibly be first, could it? I think maybe the building broke maybe? my fucking legs. It doesn't make any fucking sense. And it might be good here. Yeah, there's definitely gunfire there. Definitely. It feels like they're just able to shrug that off easily. Hmm. I'm not sure about the DMR power in this anymore. Maybe everybody's just wearing body armor. Which means I might be massively underpowered here because I'm definitely not wearing anything. I don't know, maybe next time I, uh, I should bring back that machine gun. I sort of gave it to Vizuki, but then he got killed, so yeah. And a big machine gun, that might work out. Sniper apples don't really seem to work out that well. Maybe I should get a bigger one, like a 50 cal. Maybe that'll pierce the mighty body armor. Maybe. But definitely this round they just seem to shrug that right fucking off. Wait. Can you hear that? And there we go, fucking finally, holy shit. <laughs> yeah, I think that's the same Gilly. I'm definitely not gonna have time to loot him because the server is about to restart. But, uh, I think it was a headshot, so maybe that is what we're gonna have to go for here because uh, body shots definitely don't really seem to work out that well. And I'm kinda disappointed here. I feel like everybody's got fucking gap mode except me, apparently. Yeah. Okay, that is a player. Let's try and kill that player. This time, we're definitely gonna go for headshots. First shot, headshot, clean headshot. He's gonna fall over. And it's gonna be easy.
Is that a player? Oh yeah, it is. Huh. Okay. Uh, I don't think that was the guy I was looking for though. And this could cause some issues. Because I sort of need a mech kit right now. Pretty badly. Okay, well, uh, never mind, I suppose. Apparently, I still had first aid kits. What is in his fist? I don't know, but uh, whatever, we're all good. Uh, even got his MXM, which has some cool attachments on it. And ammo, most importantly. 24 whole rounds. Or 100, actually. So, yeah, I suppose we're good on ammo. Uh, I'm fixed up as well, so. Yeah, well, I guess that's a success right there. Okay, he just got shot by somebody else. Okay, shit, two people pushing up right now. Can't get a fucking noob tube on. Or uh, push back to our car and then just fucking no, accelerate into the side. If one of those two guys that just pushed up gets shot They're all shot killing each back. other. Just sit, wait it out until someone's refueled it, and then just shoot the fire out, and then get it. Oh shit, rifle grenade. And there we go. Random fact. <laughs> <laughs> well, fuck me. Man, let's just egress ever so slowly. I don't think this is gonna end well. Clock can wreck him. I don't see anything yet. Another clock, they're in the gun store. Shoot the yeah. shit out of it. They shoot, shoot through the, the gun store. They think shoot through it. What the fuck are you? You're babbing up and down too much. He's not even bobbing up and down. But I've literally hit everything except the fucking guy running out of the gun store. <laughs> well, he must be scared shitless right now. Uh, I'll power drop in, see ya. Yeah, this gun shoots fast, doesn't hit anything, and I'm dealing with Yeah, it's awful. Already. It's fucking dog shit. Right, I'm going in night ops. <laughs> One sec. Um, Where the traces are coming from? Can't see. Wait. Yeah, right in front of us. It's like a fucking tank or something. There's a guy literally behind that dead guy, there's a guy in that tree. Fuck, did I hit him or not? Mm -mm. Woo leaf. Oh, he's lobbing grenades. And you wanna lob a grenade in my body. Wait. Okay, One sec, let me check his name. Name to name. Uh yeah, that was the guy, good job. <laughs> 